Good morning. I just want to give a little encouragement to you all today. Um, this is about following peace. Anything that's not uh, bringing you peace in your life, especially if you're trying to live for God, know that it is the Holy Spirit, likely, trying to convict you of something that is not in God's will. In Psalm 34, 14, it says, Depart from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. When you're out of the will of God, you will not have peace. I have lived it. I can testify. Um, you ever heard this little saying, you know, No God, no peace. No God, no peace. That's exactly true. When you don't read his word, and you don't go to church, and you don't you know, live for him, you can try to find peace uh, in this world in every little thing, but it's not going to bring true peace. Jesus said in 14, uh, John 14, 27, peace I leave with you. My peace I give unto you, not as the world giveth. Give I unto you, let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. So, if you are living for God and you kind of fall away just come back he will bring his peace and you will know that you are in his will because you will just have that assurance it doesn't matter what's going on it could be the worst storm of your life it could be you know death of a loved one it could be you lost your job it could be you lost your friends your husband your wife whatever but you will just have this peace only jesus can bring it so seek peace he brings you peace seek him seek first his righteousness seek first his kingdom and all these things will be added to you and he will bring you peace that this world cannot give you you can't, you can't find it in a bottle you can't find it in a you know activity of any kind just seek him. He is our peace. So I hope this helps someone today. A little quick encouragement. I haven't done this in a while. So it's hard to speak sometimes because I just, I don't know what to say all the time. So be blessed. Have a wonderful day.